sometimes in our life we struggle to fall asleep and if we're not getting good sleep in our life then our mental health can be affected so how can we as people get better sleep or fall asleep faster because some nights it's harder to fall asleep than others so here are five tips on how you can get some better <laughs> Tip number one is to make sure you have a good environment to sleep in. You can't fall asleep somewhere that's uncomfortable or loud. You have to find a good place where you feel comfortable, the temperature in the room makes your body feel good, and of course maybe you want a pillow or a blanket. So the very first tip is to make sure you find a good place to sleep. Whether it's a bed, a couch, a chair, or even on the floor, there are plenty good places to sleep you just have to find one. Tip number two is to stop using your phone. Now some people have a hard time falling asleep because they're using their phone so much and the light that comes off of your phone, it actually activates and wakes your brain up. A lot of websites online or other people might tell you that you should stop using your phone between 30, 45 minutes or even an hour before you fall asleep. Not only your phone, but this also goes for television and any other electronic devices that emit this kind of light that comes out of the screens. So don't be afraid to set your phone down. You can always pick up a book and start reading, you can always start writing, or you can just lay in bed and meditate. These are all good different options to keep yourself busy. This brings us to step number three, energy. So if you spend a majority of your day just kind of hanging around not doing too much, then at the end of the night, you might find it really hard to fall asleep because your body still has a bunch of energy. The easiest way to solve this problem is to not be chilling around all day. Yes, as a human, you can spend some of the day chilling, relaxing. I think that's important. I'm not going to say you shouldn't be doing that. However, you shouldn't spend the whole day just kind of lounging about. Instead, you should find a way to get some energy out during the day. It can be in any kind of form of exercise, running, hoop biking, skateboarding, going for a walk. All of these are great examples of how you can use your energy during the day. And if you have any other suggestions, make sure you leave them in the comments below. Number four, consumption. If it's getting closer to the night and you're eating things that aren't really necessarily healthy for you, like for example, coffee or junk food, then maybe you might be staying awake a little bit later than you want to because of caffeine or perhaps of a sugar rush. In order to combat this, I highly recommend choosing healthier options. This way you don't have any unnecessary fuel in your body that you don't want to keep you up. We are what we eat as people. So don't be afraid to switch to different alternatives. And last but not least, we have tip number four five white noise. Now for some people, even if you do all of these things, it could still be hard to fall asleep. You know, we're humans, so we have a lot of stress in our mind. We have a lot of anxiety about things going on that we can't control. So there are things at night that can keep us up. One of the easiest ways to relax your brain is by using white noise. These are outside sound sources you can have on to make your brain a little occupied. It can help your brain calm down a little bit. Examples are having a fan on, listening to a podcast, or even falling asleep with the television on in the background. Now white noise isn't for everyone. Some people don't like to listen to music when they fall asleep, or other people really dislike when they hear the television on in the background. Some people really enjoy falling asleep with the window open so they can hear the cars going about outside. Some people don't need any white noise whatsoever. Each one of us are all different kinds of humans and we all prefer different things when we fall asleep. Feel free to let me know if any of these tips helped you out, or if you have any other tips, make sure you leave them down below. Thanks so much for watching another mental health video, and as always, stay hydrated.